connected paper is all about making it easy for us to access information about almost anything. Anything with print on it should be just by a touch identified to me as a user. And if I identify it, I also can process that identity and get specific information about, for instance, a soup. Is this soup healthy to me? How was this soup produced? Is it fair? How was it transported? How far was it transported? All that stuff could be fetched by an identity connected through uh, a paper. The principle is the same. Uh, we, we have an identity inside the paint, the print. So it could be media. It could, if I touch this one, I could get an identity. It could be an augmentation. It could lead me to a video showing the Network Society video or it could be information about the company behind this, Ericsson in this case, and so on. So what we have done here now, we're taking the first initial step, entering something. We are, we are just touching upon, scratching on, upon the surface. Imagine whatever you could do with an identity and an application and the network and the cloud and so on. What we would really show off here is that paper could be part of, of a connected world in the digital way, not just by being an ordinary print. It could be part of the, the network. So going forward in the network society, everything with print on will be connected. We've added a lot of the things.